So now we're ready to go ahead and trim off all this excess fabric on this pillow. So I'm going to get my, my dressmaking shears, and these are pretty sharp scissors. They cut really well. Um, I'm just going to go in and start right here at the first mark for my piping hole where I stop and start it. And I'm going to start trimming maybe like less than, a little less than half an inch all the way around. You can leave a, bit, a little bit more if you want, but I'm pretty confident I can trim it pretty close. And then I'm going to do some other little cuts that I'm going to show you that's a trick to make your, your pillow lay real nice and, and smooth. Because round piping isn't one of the easiest things to do. Well, it's easy, but it's not as easy to make it look good. Here we go. You always have to remember to pull it just a little bit, and it makes that curve real nice and smooth. Okay, here we go. Okay, and for this area, the opening where I'm going to put my pillow insert, I'm not going to cut it as close. I'm going to go out maybe almost an inch at a couple of points, just because I don't want to... I don't want to cut it too close and not have enough to turn under. So this is about how much I have left over. So that's not too far away. Okay, so um, what I'm going to do next, I'm going to show you how to make uh, little snips around this to make it lay real nice and flat. We'll do that in the next clip. 